probe against Bhushan Singh Saran is speaking. Sources in the Delhi police are now telling us that a woman wrestler was brought to the residence of uh, WFI chief Bhushan Saran Singh. The, identify, the identity of this particular wrestler is not yet confirmed. But this is vis-a-vis -vis the probe uh, against the wrestling federation's boss as far as sexual favours and sexual harassment allegations go. In that particular investigation, we're now learning that one of the wrestlers was taken to Bridgebushan Saran Singh's residence in order to identify if that is where the alleged crime took place. Sources are now telling your channel that allegedly the victim has not been able to identify the particular location or uh, the alleged crime scene. Anshul, my colleague, getting us more details uh, from the within Delhi police. Yes, Anshul. Details that we are picking up that are at approximately 1:45 p.m. Uh, was the time when the uh, team of Delhi police, along with a wrestler, had come to the residence of Bhushan Sharan Singh. They stayed. And it was alleged by that woman wrestler that uh, she was also harassed inside the residence of Bhushan Sharan Singh. Then he wrestled and robbed Bhushan Sharan Singh. Uh, but yes, as soon as the team reached over here, they were taken to various spots inside the bungalow, is what we are being told. But that woman wrestler was not uh, able to identify the door of the room in which she had alleged. She was effectively harassed by Christian Saran Singh. Yes, the Delhi police uh, is uh, making sure that each and every angle of this entire investigation is covered so that whenever the final charges or the final report is filed, the, the, there are no low posts in this entire investigation. That is the reason why we are seeing uh, such hectic, uh, such, uh, hectic action that is being taken by the Delhi police. At 1.55 p.m. is the time that we are being told uh, that uh, the Delhi police, along with the women wrestlers, had left from the residence of Christian Saran Singh. So, yes, uh, things are getting interesting. But yes, the Delhi police are confirming this to us that the uh, investigation is in its last stages and we can expect the final charge sheet or the final file in the next few days. Now, Anshul, the Delhi police is also on a tight deadline as far as this investigation goes. It's the 9th of June. By the 15th of June is when they need to uh, file a status report at least because when the talks took place between the protesting wrestlers and the sports minister, the government came out and assured them that by the 15th of June there will be a charge sheet in this case. Uh, so yes, the Delhi police definitely have a very tight group at this point in time because remember, uh, so on one hand, there is a lot of pressure on the Delhi police to make sure that this entire investigation is done in a fair manner and that the Delhi police left because this is a very uh, critical case for the Delhi police and a very critical case. And a lot of pressure has already been built on the Delhi pressure by the way of politicians and the kind of protest. Uh, so yes, the police is trying to make sure that the timeline that they have, they can complete the investigation by then. But uh, the police is also very, very confident that the investigation has reached its last stages. They have already recorded the stages of more than 208 uh, people in this entire uh, entire investigation. These people include the close age of this insurance sector. Because remember, there was allegation that the insurance had harassed a few girls in presence of the close age of this insurance sector. Their statements have also been recorded. We'll try and reconnect that line with my colleague Anshul, who's getting us uh, the details of uh, where exactly the Delhi police's probe stands. Remember, June 15th was the deadline that was set uh, by both the protesting wrestlers and uh, the centre. That was the date that was agreed upon. Union Sports Minister came out just a few days ago and also said that there will be a charge sheet that is filed in this particular case. Several people have been questioned so far. We do know that at least seven complainants were named in the FIR against uh, uh, Bridge Bhushan Singh Saran. Let's listen in to some reactions coming in. आपने दिल्ली पुलिस के सामने स्टेटमेंट रिकॉर्ड किए हैं कैसे दिल्ली पुलिस आपके पास पहुंची और क्या कुछ आपने उनको बताया अगर आप बताना चाहते हैं 20 मई को एक देश का एक टूर्नामेंट करवा रहे थे अंडर 17 और अंडर 23 जिसकी ग्रीकोमन स्टाइल और लड़कियों की स्टाइल की कुश्तियां पटियाला एनएस में हो रही थी तो वहां पर एक फोन आया मेरे को कि भाई ऐसे ऐसे दिल्ली पुलिस ने आपका एक स्टेटमेंट रिकॉर्ड करना है और आप कहां पर हो मैंने बताया पटियाला में हूं बोले तो पटियाला में रुकिए हम आपके पास आ रहे हैं और आपका एक स्टेटमेंट लेना ठीक आ जाइए तो हमने कुश्ती करवाने के बाद 2 बजे के आसपास की बात है तो दिल्ली पुलिस की टीम पहुंची तो उन्होंने एक Mahavir forgot now joining us on this broadcast. Thank you very much for talking to us on CNN News 18. The report is that the wrestlers who complained against Bridge Bhushan Sharan Singh, Bridge Bhushan Sharan Singh, one wrestler took his home to his home. For this reason, the crime that was happening in his home was happening in his home. 
दिल्ली पुलिस का यह कहना है कि उस रेसलर को उस रेसलर से पुष्टि नहीं हो पाई एक है जो मैं तो आपके टीवी के माध्यम से पता लग गया जो पटियाला उसमें बयान बदलवाए हैं बदले हैं इससे ज्यादा पता नहीं मेरे को बट अगर ये सच है तो क्या आपको लगता है जो ये केसेस हैं ब्रजभूषण सिंह के खिलाफ उनमें ये एक सेटबैक होगा एक जो केस वो कमजोर तो पड़ेगा उसमें अगर दे रखी है जो लेकिन लड़ाई जो जारी रहेगी जो सुनिए तो पता चलेगा कि महावीर फोगाट जी कुछ दिन पहले ये खबर आई थी आ... कि जो माइनर रेस्टर थी जो जिस जिस वक्त ये क्राइम हुआ था तब जब वो माइनर थी उन्होंने भी अपना स्टेटमेंट वापस ले लिया है उन्होंने भी कहा कि जो एलिगेशन हमने लगाए थे ब्रिजभूषण के खिलाफ वो गुस्से में लिए गए थे और उन्होंने अपना बयान वापस ले लिया है अब अब एक और रेस्लर को ले जाया गया था पुष्टि करने के लिए उनसे भी वो पुष्टि हो नहीं पाई है कैसे लगता है आपको ये केस कहा जाएगा इससे आगे देखिए कोर्ट में चलेगा तो पुलिस का रिपोर्ट देखती है पंद्रह तारीख को पता लगेगा क्या आपको लगता है पंद्रह तारीख तक चार्जशीट आ जाएगी इस केस में जैसे अनुराग ठाकुर जी ने प्रॉमिस किया था कुछ दिन पहले देखिए जो प्रॉमिस किया तो सरकार का वो तो दो दिन पहले सबूत केस पंद्रह तारीख तक करेंगे वो जी जी महावीर फोगाट जी धन्यवाद हमसे बात करने के लिए हियर ऑन सी एन एन न्यूज एटीन देर इज लेटेस्ट डेवलपमेंट दैट इज कमिंग टू द फोर एज फार एज दिस रेसलर्स वर्सेस फेडरेशन सागा इज कंसर्न